This is the kind of thing that we really like to hear, a firm that is committed to charitable organizations in our community. Absolutely. And Tamara Brenninger and Frank Streck from Nuremberg Paris Law Firm joining us today to explain. Guys, thanks so much for hanging out with us. We really appreciate no, it. Thanks for having us. Absolutely. Well, as Holly mentioned, it is so powerful to have, you know, an organization like yours be so community oriented. So tell me a little bit more about why community is so important to your firm. Well, you know, community is very important to our firm. It's, it's on a day-to-day -day basis, we really help people. And taking that, that drive of what we do every day for our clients uh, to the community, it, it's just a natural piece. Um, almost everybody in the firm does something outside of the firm to help people. And so it's been a natural thing. Uh, for about eight years now, we've had a formal program to do that, a charity partner of the month. And it's just grown into that. It's just grown into it's what we do. Well, we've had several of your charitable partners on the show, thanks sure. to you, obviously. Uh, talk about Charity of the Month, the whole program, and how that works. Well, so um, each month we adopt a nonprofit from Northeastern Ohio. It's just a way to share the mission of what they're doing to make Northeastern Ohio a better place. Mm -hmm. And it's partially a social media partnership. Um, we get them exposure um, and just share their mission. And then we donate $2 back to that organization for every like that they drive to our Facebook page. So, And most of these organizations, they, they don't have the resources to get their mission out there. And, you know, as we know, day and day, there's such a need in our community. It, it really helps get the mission out there so that those people can do the, the good boots on the ground work, if you will. Right, and then right. we have dress shoes on the ground, I call it, where we're doing drives, we're doing runs, we're setting up for events, um, you name it, we're helping. I love that, and from what I understand, this is your eighth year doing this as well. Tell me a little bit more about this month's program. Well, this month, uh, veterans are a very, very core part to our community. You know, they're, they're loved, they're respected, and they should be. So we've given them two months. Uh, we've given them October and November, in which people can go to our MP4CLE site and, and nominate a vet. And you, we want to talk about what, what they get for that nomination? Yeah, we met the uh, crew from the Fisher House several months ago, and okay. we were so impressed with what they do for our veterans that we decided yeah. we'd highlight both the Fisher House and veterans for two months. So you go to NP hm.com and there's a community silo for veterans tribute and you just upload a photo if you want of your veteran fill out a little bit of information about them and we post it on the website on november 18th we will draw six names randomly if you can't vote on who a veteran is we're just mm -hmm. randomly <laughs> going to draw six names and donate five hundred dollars to six veterans and then we're matching that and donating $3,000 to the Fisher House to help oh. families. Wow. So what has the reaction been to all of this? Very, very positive. Yes. Very positive. I mean, veterans are recognized on Monday on Veterans Day, but they really should be recognized. Every day. Every mm -hmm. day. And so we've, we've given them two months um, to try to share the great things that they're doing and um, share the struggles, too, that they go through. Well, and they need to speak about mm -hmm. that, right? Absolutely. Exactly. Absolutely. Um, and I know you had a great individual on yesterday yes. sharing, helping, yeah. helping veterans. So we're, as what a an community. What inspiration that guy, oh, gentlemen. Yeah. True, true inspiration, that gentleman. So anything mm -hmm. we can do to help veterans in some very small way. And from what I understand, you guys have a Veterans Day tribute as well. So that's the tribute. Mm -hmm. The tribute is the campaign where you gotcha. nominate the veteran. Mm -hmm. um, and the veteran can be from any place. It doesn't have to be from northeastern Ohio. Yeah, you have a um, brother or a sister who has served, a, a mom or a dad or an uncle. Uh, it doesn't matter the branch of the military. Yeah. And it doesn't it, matter where they're located in the country. Yeah, the nominations are very diverse from a year of service to 28 years of service, men, women, young, um, you name it. Okay, well, let's get you all the information, and you can see the phone number. It's 216-621-2300, Nuremberg Paris Injury Lawyers. And, of course, the uh, site there is nphm.com. Thanks again for being here and for everything so that you're doing. Thank Thanks you. Thanks for spreading the message. Yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. It's incredible.
All right, well, coming up next right here on Live on Lakeside, we'll learn about another way to honor veterans this upcoming Veterans Day. Coming up right after this. This segment of Live on Lakeside was furnished by Nuremberg Paris.